Starting Monday, FEMA will begin accepting applications for its COVID-19 funeral assistance program. The agency will reimburse families up to $9,000 for the funeral and burial expenses of loved ones who died from COVID-19. News 5's Jay Jarvis spoke to a Portage County woman about how that will help her family after they suffered that devastating loss. Melissa Thompson says her dad, Donald Basham Jr., loved life and lived his to the fullest every day. Everybody who knew him knew him as the happy, you know, life of the party man. And now living without him has been almost unbearable. Basham died in early January after a weeks long battle with COVID-19. You don't have time to mentally, physically, emotionally prepare for any, you know, any of these things that are happening. And then to just have to say goodbye overnight is it's truly the worst experience of my life. Thompson says planning his funeral arrangements only added to her family's grief and stress. I was just hoping that the money could be scraped together um, to cover the funeral expenses because at that point we were so fresh with this idea that we didn't know what was going to be covered. Starting Monday, Thompson's family and others will be able to apply for help recouping some of those unexpected costs. FEMA is reimbursing families for funeral expenses related to COVID-19 deaths, up to $9,000 per funeral and $35,000 per application. Oh gosh, is, that's like a no-brainer to me. I mean, it's awesome. Marcella Boyd Cox is the funeral home director at EF Boyd and Son Funeral Home in Cleveland. She says the money will greatly help families with oftentimes very costly services. It can range up to, you know, nine, ten thousand dollars depending. This is going to be quite a relief for them. That's true for Thompson, who gave her stepmother all the information for the FEMA program. So she's ready to call and apply on Monday. Coming up with thousands and thousands of dollars is, I mean, it's not in my budget. It just makes it a little bit easier you know, to, to know that that money can be utilized for something else that's important um, for the household. We have more information about those requirements for the FEMA program and which number you can call to apply right now on our News 5 app. In Cleveland, Jay Jarvis, News 5.